Hey guys, it's Sarah McGee Beauty. I'm here with NYX Professional Makeup to show you how to recreate this fun superhero look. So first I'm going to start by going in with the Love Contours All Palette and it has two highlight shades, two contour shades, nine eyeshadow shades, and then two eyebrow shades. So using shade number 13, I'm going to go in and contour at the base of the cheekbones, at the slope of the nose, at the temples, and at the jawline. So now I'm going to take highlight shade number 11 from the same palette and I'm going to sweep that across the top of my cheekbones. I'm also going to put that shade down the bridge of my nose, onto my cupid's bow, on my jawline, on my forehead, and a little bit right under the brow. So next we're going to start the eyes and we're going to go in with the number 12 contour shade from that same palette. We're just going to put it into the crease with a fluffy blending brush and we're going to use that as a transition shade. I'm also going to use that contour shade under the eye. I'm going to go in with shade number six and I'm going to use that to deepen up the crease and the lower lash line. So now I'm going to use the matte liquid liner. This is a great black liner. It dries super flat and it stays all day, has amazing color payoff. And I'm going to use this to create a nice exaggerated wing around the eyes for definition. Using that same liner, we're going to darken up the tail end of our brow and add a few hair strokes to kind of mimic the look of pop art. So now we're going to add a crown and we're going to use the jumbo eye pencil in the shade gold. These are an amazing cream shadow stick. They are so pigmented. They're like a face paint. So now we're going to add both lips and a little star in the middle of our new crown using the NYX Slip Tease Oil. I'm using the shade Red Queen. These are an amazing lightweight formula that go on opaque and stay on all day. Now using a small angled brush, I'm going to go in and add a small red star right into the middle of the gold crown. Next, I'm going to use a flat shadow brush and the NYX Glitter Primer. This glitter primer holds your glitter in place all day so you have no fallout, no problems. I'm going to put this all over the gold part so we can add a little bit of shimmer. I'm going to go in with the gold face and body glitter. This is my favorite glitter because it lasts all day, it sparkles all day, and it's so finely ground that it just creates the most beautiful sheen. Now going back in with that matte liquid liner, we're going to outline everything on the face to really give it that pop art effect. And now I'm going to add a black outline to the crown. Last but not least, I'm going to use the white liquid liner to add some pops of highlight right on the tip of my nose, the inner corner of my eyes, and onto my lips for that real pop art effect. So there you have it. That's how you create this fun pop art superhero look. You can get all the products that I use in store or online. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I hope you have a very happy Halloween.